very special guest, the one and only Ishika Nito. So today we're here because we are having a clinic in Taiwan today. Yeah. Yeah. So this is a big tour of yours, right? It's crazy. In Hosma, Korea. And today is Taipei. And Taipei. And then Hong Kong. Hong Kong. Yeah. Manila, Malaysia. Oh, Malaysia. Malaysia. South Africa. Yes. And wow. Dubai. Very, very tight schedule. Yeah, tight. It's hard. <laughs> <laughs> so today we are having this Ibanez and the Chicanito Guitar Clinic. Actually, once we put the tickets out online, it was sold out immediately. So it shows you. Like, how popular you are in Taiwan. Actually, one of the most frequently asked questions on my personal channel is, mm -hmm. how can I get the Ichika sound? Mm -hmm. So what about today we just ask him personally, uh, who are some of your biggest musical influences? Maybe Peter Evans. I'm a big fan of him when I was three. Yeah. Three? Yeah. You have a very special playing style. How do you develop your tapping skills? Tapping skills? Uh, I learned from Toshin Abashi. Ah, Toshin Abashi. And Mahele. I was playing piano. Piano. For 15 years. Oh. And it's piano style influenced my tapping style. Uh -huh. And uh, how did you think about playing in clean tone? To clean the ideas on that style, you know, for no ポイントがあるんですけど、そこを的確に突き立てと思ったからなんですね。こう、アーティキュレーション、表現力っていうのをこう、最も正確に揺らせるポイントみたいなのがあって、で、どんどん音が歪んでいくごとにそれが幅が
like a uh, maybe you play like a scale Lega practice. Uh, only left hand? Yeah, no. Like this. Uh, ah. Only right hand. Wow. Yeah. And two fingers like a spider walking. Oh, and I see your left hand is doing the muting. The muting, yeah. And your right hand is in... You don't touch the guitar. Yeah. This, yeah. here. Yeah. Ah, so because, um, don't touch the... I don't touch the uh, ah. No. Ah. Only finger power. Ah. Only using finger mouse. Yeah, that's nice, nice. Yeah. Yeah. Ibanez guitarist. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So, what about, let's talk about Ibanez mm. guitar. Yeah. Like, why do you choose them? Uh, my first guitar I bought was Ibanez. Ibanez guitar shows me the possibilities. Like, um, it's very easy to play. I, I just yeah. realized this, it's very easy. Mm. It's a lot easier than yeah, my yeah. personal guitar. <laughs> yes. The playability is so great. Nice. So this is your signature guitar. Yeah. So that was the my first one. The first one. Yeah. And this the rest and the second one. The second one. <laughs> and uh, what uh, pickup do you usually use? My favorite position is this uh, the player, second one. Second one. Uh, uh, and fourth one. Oh, fourth one. Yeah. Ah. Front pickups and the front pickup. Yeah. yeah. So this one will be the very most travel one. Most of travel. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Most picky sound. Picky sound. Yeah. The most um, ear catchy sound. Ah, yeah. This one is more for traditional for melo sound. melody. Melody, melody. Ah, and, and these ones are for chords. Chords, chords. Ah, uh, it's melody and uh, more bold, bold sound. Ah. Mm. Uh -huh. Can you show us how you write one of your songs? Um. Okay. First, I uh, decide the root. Yeah. Uh, second, uh, chord. And uh, make us a uh, melody. Nikos is Yeah. So you start like from this. the simple chords. A simple uh, chords for root, chord, melody, rhythm. Oh. Uh, uh, final uh, articulation. Like a, uh, this is only sound. Yes. Not the musical musically. Ah. Uh, Oh, so you do the vibrato. We write vibrato and uh, slide. Yeah. <laughs> I can do it. Okay. Okay. So thank you for your time today. I think that's a very, very incredible information from you today. And thanks everyone for watching. If you like this video, please leave a like or subscribe. And then if you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment down below. I'm Ryan. I'm Let's see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.